Now we're back to CapCut. Let me show you a text color change effect. We'll start blank here and edit fall text. You may want to change the ratio. I use 60 by 9 for YouTube. Change this text to whatever you need. Let me just call this text effect. You can pick any font, any font size, any style. In our case, I want to set the color to a dark gray. Then you want to make sure that this text element is selected in a timeline. Press Ctrl C, Ctrl V so that you have to make the top one white. And now right click on it and create a compound clip. So the white one is now a compound clip. We'll go to video, then mask, and here we use horizontal. So about that, my CPU loads pretty slow today. Something seems to be happening in the background, but now it works. What you want to do now is to flip it like this so that the left hand side shows the white text and the right doesn't. Then position it so that nothing is seen at the start position. Then go to position for mask. Click on the keyframe right here. Then go to the end position, create another keyframe and then drag the mask to the right so that you can see the text fully, like this. And now if I play it, you can see it gets gradually colored. And this is basically the effect. I want to add a third element though. To do that, we'll add another default text. You want to use the letter I. You can pick a different font, but in this case, the same font works quite well. I give this kind of like a reddish color. I'm at the start position, so fold it to the left, create a compound clip, go to video, and then I reposition this to the left right here. I'm on this top compound clip, so the eye letter, I go to video basic, create a keyframe for position, and now I can drag this around. So I want to move it from the left to the right. So go to the ends, create another keyframe, and then I drag it to the right like this. And we just have to check if the position was good. We play it. And this is exactly where I want it to be. Depending on the timing between these two elements, so the eye and the white text mask, you may have to reposition the eye a little bit. But in this case, I was lucky to hit it right the first time. And this is how you can create that effect. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.